Hello, brilliant barista. Uh, here is a couple of tips during closing. Okay, um, to clean the espresso catcher, use the brush from the sink dry. And this way you don't get a bunch of clumpy, uh, messy, and then you can finish buffing it with a damp rag on the outside. But to clean out the inside, I just went over the sink and came into it like this with the brush and got the debris out of the inside with the dry brush. A lot quicker, a lot less messy. Um, okay, another secret of closing, the sink. This piece here, it, um, screws on and off and then you can clean under it and around it very very easily and then you just give it it doesn't need uh, to be screwed on tight please make note of that it does not need to be screwed on tight just a couple little rotations so that it doesn't just plop off oh and underneath here is a weak spot of uh, bacteria growth um, so I take a rag and I pull it back and forth around the bottom to get underneath clean. Okay. And then, um, another quick tip, sorry to make you dizzy, is when you're wiping things down, have a damp cloth in one hand and the best way to have your cloth uh, which um, remember our color system the yellow ones are for the counters um, so you want to let's see how I can prop my phone this is my second video ever so we will get better at this okay so, you want to get your rag wet, but then wring it out the best possible. Really, really wring it out. Then, you want to mist it with the all-purpose cleaner. And make sure you're doing it spraying towards the sink, never spraying towards the inside of the hut. Um, so now your rag is damp and sprayed with the cleaner and you go around wiping with the rag and then the secret is to follow it up with a clean dry rag and that gives you the final touches of cleaning a surface. Um, with the rags. All right, that's good for this video. See you at the next one.